and counting until the annual Blarney blowout in Amherst this weekend. Police say they're ready for the March tradition, which has been relatively quiet over the last few years. Western Mass News reporter Sarah Ganelli with more. Students at UMass Amherst are gearing up for some of their own St. Patrick's Day fun this weekend. Blarney blowout, obviously a big event here at UMass. Um, big Irish event. The Blarney blowout stretches around campus. Over the past few years, the Amherst Police Department has worked hard to come up with a good game plan. Going back to five years or so ago when we really started bringing in our mutual aid partners, uh, we have a pretty complex and um, set up as far as bringing in additional officers, um, doing a lot of community outreach, outreach with a lot of the students. Western Mass News spoke with Chief Scott Livingstone, who says they're bringing in more than 100 officers. We bring in agencies from all around Western Mass. It typically numbers somewhere between 125, 150 officers. The department will be keeping a close eye on areas that have had issues in the past, such as Hobart Lane, the Townhouse Apartments, Phillips Street, Fearing Street, and Lower Main Street. And the school is also hosting a concert at the Mullen Center. Students say it's a good idea. They're bringing some people in to perform, so that'll be good, and it'll get everyone together in like one place. Western Mass News reached out to UMass and received a statement that reads in part, The university and the town of Amherst have a very comprehensive plan in place since the past years, which has proven to be successful. It includes outreach to local businesses and property managers. One policy in place this weekend, no guests will be allowed on campus or in the Mullen Center. But no matter what, police say they are ready for the weekend. We're going to have a real safe weekend. Sarah Gurnelli, Western Mass News.